<laughs> Joe and I, Joe and I are having a deep conversation about organization and the need for it, and we have it. So, and we're working on it. We have the whole floor going and everything, but that's not about. It's not about internals of Mustang Medic right now. This is about a complicated wiring harness on a GT350. Joe's finding other things, and unfortunately, you know, it's like, oh, it's a forty. It wasn't totally unexpected, it's, but it's, yeah, it's, it's but it's a worse. but it's getting worse. But we're getting we're dealing with it. So here's more details on issues that we're having with uh, putting in this wiring harness. You explain to me like you did before before you actually show it to me what you just found and how that connected. Well, I've actually thing. found a couple already. There's, there's factory wires that are supposed to be like plugged in that are like crypt connected together. And now I've got to cut them wires to get it, get the harness out. And then, then I got to put the ends back on them the right way. So, so everything works for the next guy. Yeah. Is there a visual for me to, to show um, anything or is it too hard to see? Yeah, let's see. There's like right here. See? This wire, it goes around and down and over and under, and somebody's put a crimp connector on it. It's, it's, it's. I, I don't know if somebody's repaired it or if it's got. And this, this thing here, this wire was literally wrapped around that main harness right here four times. Somebody did that because that's a crimp connector. That's not a factory piece there. That, somebody did that. I don't know why they did that it. That was a ground or something, right? Yeah, it was a ground. Right. And, and it was on this screw facing that way. Right. So I had to reach behind here to try to get the screw out, right. and, and it was also holding the relay. It just, it just, right. It's constant. It's constant. Yeah, and uh, Joe's a very good electrician, and he gets very frustrated when he sees bad electricians work. And unfortunately, in 47-year-old cars, 40-year-old cars, it's going to happen. Gonna happen. Get it, we get it, but again, it makes the job go longer, uh, which we don't want it to do. But it's the reality of it. So. Just one other thing, whoever installed the stereo, they ran wires a whole length of this harness, intertwining all the stuff, so I gotta disconnect all that. Yeah, they were just sticking it through. Yeah. Um, the good news is for the person that purchases this car, purchases this car, yeah, buys, um, it. buys it, they're gonna see that all the wiring and everything is done uh, in the car, done right here at Mustang Medic, which again, adds intrinsic value. We're asking $120,000 for this gorgeous Shelby, documented, uh, Hertz of Rent Eraser. And uh, we're going to get this job done right, uh, no matter how long it takes. And you're going to see the value when you buy the car. And hey, if nobody buys it, Bill's got the value built in because we did the work. So one way or the other, our client wins. And that's what it's about at Mustang Medic.